Hello Aquarius, this is your August 2018 reading on what you have to surrender this month. Um, keep in mind this is a general reading, so it may or may not resonate with you. Um, and this could apply to any situation in your life. So, you know, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. So let's get started. Um, so bottom of the deck overall energy you have is um, surrender denial. Accept people and situations exactly as they are without denying the difficulties. Then you can see things clearly and make the best decisions. So some of you guys are in denial about a situation, about a person. Oh, jeez. So sorry, guys. Um, yeah, so the first card out, you have surrender to the magic of who you are. We all have magic in us, even in the mundane aspects of life. Remember that you are a magical being with a uniqueness and worth that come from just being you. So this month, really just surrender to you know, to being your authentic self, be you this month. Um, you know, nobody is you, you are unique. We are all unique. Um, you know, just surrender to who you are this month, get in touch with who you are. You know, always, always be yourself, no matter what, in any situation that, that you face, always be yourself. And people gravitate, you know, towards um, authenticity. People love people who are, are um, authentic. Um, you know, no one likes being around someone who's um, fake. Um second card we have is surrender defensiveness defensiveness is a sign of weakness to communicate in a more empowered way stay centered and hear someone out then offer a clear non-defensive response um yeah so i feel like you guys are on the defensive about something. You guys are being defensive, Aquarius. Or maybe it's um, this other person or this other party that's being defensive. Um, but there's defensiveness uh, surrounding the situation that you're in this month. Um, but since this is your reading, I feel like this is you guys. I feel like you guys might be, might be um, a little stubborn might be feeling that way, might be feeling stubborn or defensive. Um, you know, it's really important to get grounded this month. Um, take the time to meditate, to center yourself, do some yoga maybe. Um, whatever keeps you calm, whatever keeps you balanced, stick to a routine. Um, but be willing to listen to others. Be willing to hear other people out. Really listen. Try to have more of an open mind. But I feel like you guys are pretty open-minded. It's just that this defensiveness is getting in the way. Of you really being able to to listen to others. Um, the third card you have is surrender your need to always be right. Give others the gift of letting them be right. Be yielding, not rigid. This will help resolve conflicts and improve your relationships. So, yeah, um, you guys might feel um, that you are right. Um that what you have to say is right and that's that um and what did I say about you know like being stubborn you know like don't 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 be rigid this month um 
you know, pick and choose your battles. Sometimes the argument isn't always worth it. You know, what's more important, being right or um, your your um, your other person, your friendship, your um, whatever this is. And then the fourth card out you have is surrender to your soul's path. Your life's journey has been perfectly designed for your soul's growth. Embrace every lesson and every moment. So yeah, I feel um, nature would be very therapeutic for you guys as well. Maybe even flowers because there's flowers in this card. Maybe somebody's getting flowers. Um... Even water is therapeutic, could be therapeutic for you guys this month. Try and um, spend some time out in nature if you can. Um, yeah, but just trust that um, there is um, a higher uh, plan for you, um, that the universe is um, working in your favor the universe is conspiring in your favor um you know your your angels and your guides are with you and helping you along your soul's path and you know whatever challenges you're going through right now it is for um your soul's growth So let's pull from the universe has your back deck and just see what other messages come out for Aquarius, August 2018. Sorry if these are a little late, guys. Jesus. Ah, oh, I'm so sorry that I keep freaking doing that. Okay, so So bottom of the deck, overall energy. You have my happiness is a direct reflection of my level of faith in the universe. So, yes. You know, when you are completely, um, you know, like when you have complete faith in the universe, that the universe um, will deliver what it is um, that you are asking for, um, it's going to come through as, um, happiness, you know, you need to get, um, and in order to receive what it is that the universe, you know, is trying to deliver to you in order to receive what it is that, that you're asking the universe for, um, you need to get in, um, the vibrational alignment of happiness, So the card that we have paired with surrender to the magic of who you are is the moment I realign with love, clear direction is presented to me. So yes, be you, be authentic, surrender to who you are, realign with love. the higher universal energies, the, the frequencies of, of love. You could even do some, what is it? Is it 432 Hertz meditation? Is that the right one? That could help too. Um, yes, but I, um, even meditation, I feel, 
you know, when you guys um, surrender to being your authentic self, you're just going to start aligning with what it is that 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 you love to do. You're going to start aligning more with love. And I feel like, um, you know, directions and opportunities will be presented to you. It'll all be clear to you. Everything will become clear. Like you will know who you are, becoming clear um, about who you are. Becoming clear on, you know, what, you know, what is your authentic self? Maybe, you know, maybe, maybe your talents or something like that. The uh, second card that we have paired with Surrender Defensiveness is I am a, um, it says I am a spirit having a human experience and I'm here to get closer to love. Um, I'm sorry, that was, that was my laptop. I was watching a, a vlog. Um, so yes, the surrender defensiveness. So yeah, we are all, you know, we are the universe. We are spirit having a human experience. You know, we, we are the universe experiencing itself, essentially. Um... You know, we came here on this planet to love, to be loved, to spread love, to raise um, the, the vibrations, um, you know, of, of, of the planet. Um, and defensiveness is not in alignment with love. That's not how you will get closer to love. That's not how you will get closer to um, your other person. That's not how you will solve your your problem uh, you know align with love realize that you know you are a spirit having a human experience you're here to love to give love to receive love to be love to get closer to love learn through love to shut my window okay so third card that you have paired with surrender your need to always be right is there is nothing se sexier than my authentic truth yeah so just speak your truth your authentic truth don't lie don't sugarcoat anything you know don't be mean be truthful be you know be truthful be honest be clear you know, just be direct. Use your intuition. I feel like, you know, with the moon here, this does require you to use your, your intuition. Um, signifying of emotions as well. Maybe, you know, emotions are, are running high. Maybe you will speak your truth around, like, the full moon. Um, yeah. You know, but just don't be stubborn. Don't, don't be rigid. Be open to hearing, you know, and hearing out others, to listening to others. Surrender your need to be right. And, you know, listen to others. And when it's your turn to speak... Be authentic, be yourself, come from a place of love, compassion, speak your authentic truth, and I think you'll find that everything will work out beautifully. You know, surrender denial about this situation, about, you know, maybe you're thinking um, whatever this is is not going to work out. Um, surrender that. That's just um, another blockage and it's creating resistance. You're blocking your abundance that way. 
The fourth card that you have uh, paired with surrender to your soul's path is when I'm connected to my joyful presence, I attract support from the universe. So yes, when you surrender to the path that is meant for you, the path that you are meant to be on, your soul's journey, when you are joyful, when you are in, you know, a, a vibrational alignment of joy, when you are having fun, enjoying life, you know, the universe, you will attract support, abundance from the universe. You know, and you'll find that that when you are truly walking um, your soul's path, um, your your calling, um, walking your destiny, um, you know, you are going to be in a state of joy. You're going to be um, more, you know, present. You're going to be living more in the moment and you'll find that um, when you live more in the moment too you naturally start um, aligning um, in a joyful filled state and you'll automatically just start attracting support from the universe you know, and the universe responds very well to gratefulness. You know, so try to be grateful for um, the obstacles in your path because it's only meant to serve you, to grow you. Just try and, um, you know, be in a state of joy and trust the path um, that you're on and you know, and the universe is supporting you. So, um, yeah, I don't know. I hope you guys liked this video, Aquarius. Please comment, like, share, subscribe if you did. Everything you need to know is in the description box below. Um, yeah, hope it resonated. Um, and I'll see you guys soon with another video. So until then, Bye.